In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to disable Microsoft Edge Web View 2 in 2024. This process can be especially helpful if you're experiencing issues or simply need to temporarily halt its operation for troubleshooting purposes. Follow along as I guide you through each step in a clear and concise manner. First, we need to access the task manager and there are a couple of ways to do this. The quickest way is by pressing the Ctrl, Shift and S key keys on your keyboard simultaneously. This combination will instantly bring up the task manager window. It's your go-to tool for monitoring and managing running applications and processes on your computer. Once you have task manager open, you'll notice several tabs at the top. Navigate over to the details tab. This tab provides a comprehensive view of all the processes currently running on your system, allowing you to manage and troubleshoot various tasks. Let's go ahead and click on it. Now, with the details tab open, it's time to locate the WebView2 process. You'll want to look for a specific process named msedgewebview2.xe in the list. To make things easier, you can organize these processes alphabetically by clicking on the name column heading. This simple trick might help you quickly locate the required process without much hassle. Upon finding msedgewebview2.xe in the list, the next step is to end the task. Go ahead and right click on the process. A context menu will appear, presenting you with several actions you can take. Here, your focus should be on selecting the End Task option. By doing so, you instruct your computer to terminate this particular process. Ending the task helps to disable Microsoft Edge Web View 2 temporarily. However, you should be aware that this merely stops it from running at the moment, and it might restart with future system operations, depending on your usage. If you're looking to address specific issues or tweaks, this interruption might clear up any temporary glitches, but more permanent changes may require different settings or configurations. There you have it. Disabling Microsoft Edge Web View 2 is as simple as opening the task manager, navigating to the details tab, locating the process, and ending the task. Use this method as needed, keeping in mind that this is a temporary measure. As we wrap up, I hope you found this tutorial both insightful and practical. Whether you're modifying system functionality for improvement or troubleshooting existing issues, these technical know-hows can be empowering. Be sure to check back for more tips and guides to help you maximize your tech experience. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.